Now, there were quite a few cups of coffee and we've uh, saved seven copies of that edited video, each labelled carefully with the dimensions and the frames per second and the actual type of video that it has uh, come out as. We can see over here that uh, Windows Media Audio, the um, pocket, that's the format for the pocket PC. Flash video comes out as flash video. The iPhone comes out as an MP4. Um, this MP4 comes out as a movie clip. Uh, that's actually a huge file, a 70 megabyte file. The others are really uh, considerably smaller. This one here, which is a, a large screen size in a flash format, the old flash format, is actually that's the new flash format, uh, is considerably smaller. Now, one thing we have to be very careful of is that we make sure we save our edit file. So I'm going to make sure that that goes, instead of going right there into the middle of the elements file, that I go into my libraries, my videos, my, not my, yeah, my PT1 sample videos, and I can put my all of the... Uh, project files in there. So that way I can bring all this across to any other machine, to one of the college machines, open it up and I'll have much uh, a much better chance of editing it, playing each section. If I come here and I play a short section, uh, trying to work out what the various, uh, a bigger screen is handy as well of course, I'll bring that up there. So I can see all the little clips here. We've got explosions and goodness knows what happening. Uh, let's go in there, play just a touch. Quite often, okay. Let's delete that section there. Delete and see what the difference is. Uh, I'm pushing the space key to get a go. And see now, it, the, the picture won't play properly. It's because there's not enough power in this machine. So I'm going to end the video here now. I'm going to be doing Control Z to put that little piece back, and uh, or I can save the video without changes now. And uh, you can save different versions as well. File, save as, and you can save it as version one, two, three. That's handy because you quite often get crashes with working, you know, working with files of this size. Okay.